People who wear hoodies when it is 100 degrees out. Why? I can see many people commenting about how they want to hide their bodies or scars and injuries from self-harming. Just breaks my heart. I send my support for all those folks who deal with such troubles. My reason is much less sad, more weird. I have Raynaud's disease. Or something similar to it. It causes the arteries in my extremities to constrict too much under exposure to cold or stress. Or just whenever they feel like it. I guess. It's really random. Most of my family has it. As do my grandparents on my dad's side, so it seems to be genetic. We don't get overheated as easily as most people. And our hands and feet are pretty much always icy cold no matter the day or time. If I'm wearing a hoodie outside and the sun is blazing hot and you could cook an egg on the sidewalk. I'm either legitimately cold or just haven't realized it's hot out there. How else do you expect me to steal the ducks from the park? My fashion in high school was. Put a hoodie on and suck it up. Is it 100 degrees? Put a hoodie on and suck it up. Is it minus 30 degrees? Put a hoodie on and suck it up. Mosquitoes. They love me. I hate them. I want to know about the people who wear shorts when it's below freezing out. Depression is strange. I live in Texas and I'd still wear a hoodie most of the time going to school even if it was May. You wake up in the morning when it is cooler outside and your room is possibly cold too. The first thing you see is the same hoodie you wear every day since it is easy and comfortable. Then you throw it on real quick and go. Not much thought. Gets regrettable when it is truly hot out, but at the time it just didn't matter to you. NGL it's usually low self-esteem or confidence issues. Or aesthetic fashion purposes I guess. But I used to wear hoodies every day to hide my body. And I live in Florida. Until I passed out from the heat one day LMAO. Because I don't like to carry a purse but still need pockets for my few things. Keys. Phone. Wallet. Women's clothing is so stupid. The pockets are typically too shallow to fit anything useful. Also. When a dress has pockets and I carry things in them. The items in my pocket hit against my legs when I walk. Hoodies solve these problems. Self-harm. Not for a very long time now. But my early teen years I wore the same two hoodies constantly. Even when I slept. Cuz I fat. I'm one of those people who are always cold. Sometimes I wear two sweaters. Jacket. Two pairs of socks and sweatpants under my jeans. I probably have some disease or some shit. Because I was too lazy to put on a bra. Mont's not hot. I'm insecure about my body. I'm more tattooed than I'm not. I wear a thin hoodie or long sleeved shirt fairly often in the summer. Especially when driving. Because the sun fades the shit out of tattoos and I don't always feel like putting on sunscreen. No sense in putting a lot of time and money into well done tattoos to have them fade. I'm on the Asperger's spectrum. And something about the hood around my head makes my sensory issues much more bearable. And makes me feel safer. I did this in high school. And I'm just gonna say it. I saw Anakin doing this in episodes 2 and 3 and thought he looked dope as fuck. I figured I'd look cool if I did this too. I'm insecure and I prefer being a shapeless blob over having people actually see me. Depression. Long sleeves make me feel safer when I'm depressed. Don't know why. But it's something I've let the people close to me know if I'm wearing long sleeves when it's hot out. I'm not okay. I'd rather boil inside the hoodie than fry in the sun. Sun protection is of greater importance than heat protection. Skin cancer all the way up the family tree. No SPF will cut it. I had to break off my relationship with the sun and go no contact. I highly recommend ultralightweight running jackets for daily summer wear. I'm thin and it's comfortable. I'm insecure. Don't know what for. I've got a hoodie addiction. Cover scars. Because it stops the staring. I have many scars running up and down all sides of my arms from self-harm. When I work up the courage to go outside with short sleeves it often leads to a lot of people staring. Many times people bring it up which really sucks but even worse is when I hear other people bring it up among themselves behind my back. Summary. 1. People with sensory processing issues, ASD, SPD, etc. 2. People with poor body image, whether from dysmorphia, dysphoria, or being overweight, underweight. 3. People physically covering up self-harm or psychologically covering up depression. Also sometimes track marks. 4. People feeling unmotivated to wear bras or something more formal. Edit. 
What I believe we've concluded here is that if you know someone who persistently wears hoodies, sweatshirts, or long sleeve tees when it's inappropriate for the weather, think about checking in with them to make sure they're okay. The only innocent, ASD is still a problem, and they might also need to be checked on because social isolation, comorbidity. One of these reasons is no. 4. Except if it happens regularly. It could be a symptom of depression. Thanks. Because sometimes I don't feel like wearing a bra and rather sweat than be restricted. I have self-harm scars from years ago and people either make fun of them or pity me. Just leave me alone, man. Because shade from the sun. And because I like hoodies. Edit. My theory is correct. If you comment on at least 15 new posts in Ask Reddit at least one will get to hot. Suffered from anorexia for about a year now. I look like a stick and I kinda don't want to show that off to the world. Why no? Any weather is sweater weather when you've got body image issues. 100 degrees Fahrenheit is 37 Celsius for those who aren't from USA. Dies in European. I like operating from the security of a pouch. Barcode arms. Body dysphoria. Isolation X100. Helps with disconnecting from people. It's like you are in your own small world without getting into the spotlight. Hoodies are comfy. They make me feel safe. Sometimes I'm too lazy to take them off. Sometimes I don't want to wear a bra. Sometimes I know it'll be cold inside wherever I'm going and walking outside for a few seconds in the heat is fine. Ever seen a fishing shirt? It's a hoodie made out of quick dry material, the hood keeps the sun off your neck and face and you seem to stay cooler than you'd be if you were wearing a t-shirt. Dysphoria. Slash. Though I gotta say I wear hoodies just bc I am insecure about la body weight. Cuz we like to hide shame shame with hood hood so it makes us feel good good. Because being snuggly is nice and also more reason to eat ice cream. If I was to take it off I have nowhere to put it. Eating disorder, self-harm gang rise up. Everybody sing it with me now I hate my body. I hate my body. I am so skinny that you could see obvious bone and I got tired of being called a skeleton. My son is autistic and wears a hoodie every day all day. Allows him to put the hood up to get a little distancing for his senses. Because 1. I only have so much clothing. 2. I'm insecure about my body. 3. Self-harm scars. Usually it's because I don't want to put a bra on. And the hoodie hides my jiggly saggy tits better than a tank top does. So I'm basically 15 years old kid. And I'm skinny as frick. I don't know how to say it in pounds. But my weight is 38 kilograms. Which makes me not the skinniest guy in class. But skinniest person in class. My body is that skinny to the point my arms looks like bones. So I wear hoodies at summer to look kinda THICC. Depression. I constantly fat shame myself too. I know the hoodie doesn't hide my 300 pound gut too well, but at least I don't have to look at it all the time compared to when I wear tank tops. Big boobs feel uncomfortable too. Especially with a sports bra. Don't wanna get too cold greater than underscore greater than. There's X's drawn with pen all over my arm and I have to hide it. Sun protection. Because I'm not wearing a bra. Mont's not hot. Because it's fucking comfy Henry. Fuck you you fucking prick. I can maybe get a few seconds in direct sunlight before I'm burned. I scratched the hell out of the inside of my arms when I got nervous and then kept doing it because they always itched so bad. I wore a hoodie to cover them for a long time. They're better now but now I just can't stand the cold BC I got used to the hoodie. We're hackers so we have to. Because I can. While we're at it explain why people crank the AC and wear a hoodie and sweatpants around the house? Cuz it was the first thing I saw. Being reminded that I have boobs makes me want to peel my skin off more than the heat does. Drug withdrawal. To hide the track marks. Because I'm almost always cold and if I go inside somewhere or even in a car where the AC is blasting. I will almost always be freezing and regret not bringing a hoodie. I don't mind the heat, but I really mind the cold. If I encounter it. Because my office is freezing and I wear a hoodie to keep warm. When I go outside, it feels so good to be warm that I keep my hoodie on because it's part of the thawing process. Edit. Spelling. Respect the drip Karen. 
QLSNO Ohm. I keep my apartment cold and run cold so when I'm outside in the heat it doesn't bother me. If anything it's ultra cozy with a warm breeze. Also, it hides the boobies. I used to do it. Not much anymore, but for sure insecurity. And I have eczema really bad and people would say, what's that on your arms? Like I don't know it's there. There is something to be said for the right hoodie being worn when it's too fucking hot. I went on a hike a few years ago. It was approximately 85 to 95 F and I wore my hoodie. It actually kept me relatively cool. And the shade around my head was fantastic. I am insecure about how skinny my arms are. However recently I found out about a thing called Overleash's long sleeve dried it so I found a replacement. Because my arms look like you can scan them at Target and I don't want to be touched by little kids while their parents call me a psycho and their grandparents get a heart attack. Because that happened before.